we had no idea that we would be making the film that we have today when we started making the film. It was purely a workshop based, like let's see where creativity takes these kids. And then the story just started and exploded in our faces. And then what we have today is what happened. Nas Bandino or Hide and Seek is a documentary film that follows five years in the life of Anthony. He's this young, naughty street kid, but very lovable. As this decree comes in that the government has placed to fight organized crime, and they crack down on kids like Anthony. Anthony's taken away to a family home, and he escapes, not once, but repeatedly, and that ends him up to where we see him in the end. I knew I wanted to make a film about these difficult neighborhoods of Naples. I want to speak about criminality, but I don't want to be, have drugs and weapons in it. I want to see what the psychological effect is of this whole environment. I want to understand why it's self-perpetuating, why the cycle just doesn't end without it being about drugs and weapons and just sensationalizing everything. Our film is very close and personal, very intimately shot, um, and obviously we had to create a lot of trust in our characters. That comes from before, from the initial approach, where I know the kids through the social worker, through workshops, through sort of NGO work. Um, but it also comes through endless dinners, endless um, sort of gift giving, just you know, whatever little thing, like a sweet or whatever, spending so much time with them. I allowed them to do my nails. I bleached Anthony's mum's hair. Um, it took six years. They, they are family. They are definitely family. Natalia, who's Anthony's mother, when she watched it, she was crying from the first second. And at the end of the film, she just gave me the biggest hug and say, I've never felt so seen. Like, we really feel that this film is about us and it's very true. And that to me was, yeah, the biggest success that we've ever had with this film was them being able to say, to say that. Mm -hmm.